Hello and welcome back to Terraforming Mars Solo Challenge. I did a couple of rerolls because I was looking for Helion or UNMI. Some of the corporations we haven't played um, in a long time, or we've only played a couple times. You know, we have Inventrix and Tharsis so many times that uh, I'm starting to feel bad at this point. So, Helion, looking for heat production cards. Nothing great. AI Central, though. And industrial center, standard tech, mining rights. I feel like. How many of these can we play in the first turn? Like, we can't play AI Central, don't get me wrong. I'm not trying to play AI Central. What I'm thinking is if we only need to get two more science tags, we take it for sure. And then I just up our steel production like crazy with industrial center. And maybe I throw the mine down on titanium. We're on steel. I don't know, but I kind of I kind of like this. We're doing the classic Helion thing of like, guess we don't actually care about, uh, about productions after all. Um, I'm going to start with the industrial center. And I'm going to place it on the steel. And I'm gonna activate it to increase our production. Thumbs up, great times. Uh, and then we're gonna mining rights using that steel. Oh, I meant to grab the great escarpment. Shoot. Uh, and we'll grab the titanium production just for a little bit of diversity. Yeah, if we had to take, we could have spent 10 more dollars and had another steel production right now. It's more expensive than spending the seven as an action every turn, but I uh, I think we want the steel because I want to get AI Central down, and that's that's a lot of steel to play. Um, let's see, we're already spoken for in terms of like in terms of seven dollars that I want to use to increase our steel production. I like the two cards. But I'm, it's not really worth spending $8 to get two cards that are random. If I grab both of these, I can play this one. I can play this one. That's a total of $12, $18, and we still have enough left to play um, to up our steel production. And do this? Like, not play it, but draft it. 9 plus 12 is 21 plus 7. We have just enough. So, Micro Mills is really a not great card. Oh, plus we can use energy if we ever uh, get tight. Micro Mills is not a great card. Uh, but this early in the game, there's just so many rounds of production that there is value in it. We do not want to use any heat. Heat, the biggest Helion trap I can think of is the fact that heat is better served as heat. So using it for money is decent if you do it a little bit in the early game just to get that little bit of a bigger card down a turn early or something. But in general, I would consider it a big nope. These are all very powerful. And we're not gonna play a couple of them right away, but we need that science tag anyway. So can we not get this down? I thought we could. Hmm. Why can't we get it down? Seven. We have enough. The game just doesn't know. Oh, we don't have energy. I, I, I. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking. Um. Which is fine. Which is fine. We just want to up our steel production. The cards are all worth it, especially since we'll have six steel next turn. The energy, I'd like I'd love to get a card for the energy, but the standard technology will make it at least doable. Though that was a huge um you you make a lot of money selling steel and plants, so I would have really liked oh my god. You know what I wanna do? You know me well enough to know exactly that I'm looking at both of these and going, they synergize together, 
we have space tags, it's early enough in the game, we're already going down a science tag strat, we have extra cards for science tags. The only question is, do I take the investment loan? So we can actually get this stuff down. Because the way I'm looking at it now is, let's say I take this, we have $8 left. That's not enough to buy standard tech and electro catapult and stuff. But maybe with the loan we can. Oh, because we have $9, so. So this is six. We have $8 left. Then we take the loan. That puts us up. We have eight, and then that's plus seven. So 15, we buy an energy for 11, which is eight. 15. I'm just trying to figure out, you know, after that we have $7, seven plus 12 is, is, is just barely enough. I was trying to figure out if we could Olympus conference before standard tech. We cannot. We're going to be losing a money production to do this, which is really too bad. But I know that it's worth it. Because this extra money that you make here is just so good. Uh, we are going to have to sell a plant, which is unfortunate. Why do we have more than one action? Oh yeah, because we can buy or sell production. Which we do. Boo, bop, we do. So now we're up to four steel production. And we've got plenty to use the steel on. Think about this four as just a money income right now. I mean, we want heat production though, it'd be nice. We're gonna need an energy, so that's an easy grab. Then I wanna sell a steel. Then I want to think about this. I think we want to Olympus Conference for four. And then we're gonna spend the titanium on this despite it being an overpayment and all the rest of it. Oh, I think I just saw the card that everybody's dreading for me to see. Earth Catapult. I can't, I don't know if I can do Earth Catapult and AI Central, like, obviously that's crazy, right? Yes, Matt, it's crazy, but is it? Because we Earth Catapult, then we Artificial, we're going to get a Deep Bowl Heating Bump. It's crazy, but I'm going to do it. Do you know why I'm going to do it? Does it, it? It probably lowers our win chance by like 50% to play it at this point in the game. Genuinely, like it's 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 that bad of a play for our position. But it's Earth Catapult. <laughs> if you get Earth Catapult and AI Central, we can't even grab Lake Marineris, which is really too bad. If you grab these, question is, can I play it this turn? I can. The reason I can play it this turn. Again, this is this is a trap. We should be spending that steel, but oh, and we we could have if we had just sold our friggin' steel first. Oop, they've. But we want a deep well heating anyway, don't we? 
We're in a very privileged position right now because we can up our steel production one more time. But I think what's more important is that we just grab this. We get the energy production and a science tag. That brings us up to three. Next turn, we're gonna have nine steel, eight if we sell one. Bam, AI central, start getting cards up the wazoo. Everybody's, everybody's happy, high-fiving all around, everything worked out, nobody's mad at Matt. Acer's real box, Acer box for doing this. Everything worked out. Um, we don't need energy because I drafted those cards. The Steelworks is too good to pass up because we will have a lot of energy. So, uh, first is first, we sell. Even at this point, buying more steel production is not crazy. We use as much of it as we can, down to $3. We get a card, sweet. We're gonna get two more cards. There's no way I'm not taking this action first. Fueled fat, or Radchem factory is pretty good. But now we do this bad boy. And I think I'm willing to give up three heat now to have six energy next turn, which will then turn into heat if we don't use it. But we are gonna use it because I drafted uh, the metals, Steelworks, which is gonna put our, our oxygen really quick. Look at this, minus six on Miranda Resort. Tags, we have two Earth Tags, no Earth Tags coming. I'm gonna do it. It's not a great play, but it just a couple, $2 per turn for ostensibly free. Another basically free card is going to be Power Infrastructure. I've never used it before because I don't think it's a great card to turn your energy into money because it's not efficient. But damn, these are now we're getting good cards. Like this is good and this is good. We can do it. I like the titanium mine as well. You know I do. How many of these can we actually play though? We sell a green. I mean we want we want building tag cards. We have five steel production. So two more cards. This is why we have Earth Catapult, by the way. Specifically because I'm crazy. There's another Earth tag, in case you're uh, not peeved enough at the uh, the early play. I'm going to sell a plant because there's a lot I want to get done this turn. Steelworks I think is first because then we can activate it. Look at that, our first TR. <laughs> yeah. Um. This is cool because it's four heat, but this is also three income, and right now that's kind of just what we're using it for. And the reason I was okay selling the plant is because with the plus two, that gets it back up. And then we spend the rest of our friggin' titanium. I'm only questioning is if we can get both. And I think the answer is yes. We get a titanium here. Get both, what do you mean? Oh no, we can't get both unless I did that one first. Cause see, we have $8 in, if you consider both. So two here and then six, but then we'd be in a really weird spot. We could still sell a card though. Is any of this worthless? I mean, I keep spooling around and around, and I'm not willing to sell anything other than the power infrastructure. So, clearly it's not that great of a card. Okay, I think it's time to start considering doing a heat bump as Helion. 
Uh, uh, a big asteroid. Hell yeah, minus six. Points card here that I almost never get to play because I always run out of monies. And this half off, basically. What am I doing to myself? I keep doing that over and over and over again. And every time you guys are screaming, you don't have the monies. You have no monies. Why are you buying more cards? You can't play them. I can play them. I've got actions to get money. Seventeen dollars and twelve heat, in fact. And then the tie, or and then the steel. I mean, Mohol is just great. This is free, and I'm gonna play it. Um, Mohol is amazing. Radchem is pretty great. Domed Crater is income, but so is Protected Valley. We got a lot of heat bumps coming. Mahol. I think we do it for the titanium, because it's worth the most. And then we do an early big asteroid for exactly seven titanium because it's free. We get four back. Is it time to drop two oceans? I think so. Uses all our money though. Is there a production card we want to buy? Couple of them. If we do this, we have exactly enough for the heat bump that I want to get the other heat bump. It sounds convoluted, but. Can't not grab two cards here. Earth Catapult, man, I'm telling you, we benefit from having card cards. Lots of cards. Here's the heat bump. Hell yeah, brother. Sabotage. And then we'll go in and grab two plants here. Because plant strats. Can we get more plants next turn? Maybe. Can we get more plants this turn? Four dollars. So we could sell this card. We could sell this card. And we could sell the cities. I think that you guys would be happy with me not having all of these cities. Like capital, that's just a late game point card. Underground city, we don't need more steel. Sabotage, bad. Power infrastructure, if I've ever I was gonna use it, that time has passed. There we go. Brings us up to an even 4-4 four, four for plants. Whoo, Nelly. We need to heat the planet, and we need to heat it quickly. Real quick. We have so much energy. And now I'm looking at these. You know I am. Because we, we, we could, could we, like what are we, 20 gives us two oxygen. How many Jovian tags do we have? Just one. I won't grab Terraform and Ganymede. And I won't grab Mars University. And I, and I won't grab Commercial District. Just for you, dear viewer who thinks I'm crazy. We're going to sell a steel because we need our plantos. Gonna do this. We're gonna check it first just in case. Nah. I mean, we'll play this for the free point. Um, oxygen. Strip mine. Two oxygen there too. We almost have the oxygen heat bump. We could even get it this turn with just a little bit of protected valley.
Where would I like to protect it, Valley, though, is my question. If I did it on the steel, then I could get Radcam and still have enough leftovers to do the other things I want. It's an awkward place to have a greenery, but I really would prefer to have rad chems. I keep saying we need to do heat bumps, and then I keep using our heat as money, but like, again, that's the Helion strat. You, you spend it as money early just to get that engine a little bit further off the ground. But like, it's hard to argue that if you spend $8, like eight heat as dollars or credits or whatever you want to call it, um, you're really forgoing the eight credits uh, for a TR. The heat bump is, is good. And progressing the game. We don't need these cards. Um, despite loving kelp. Bam! Just like that. Acquired companies all the way down to $5. And would produce $3 three times. Somebody's going to do the math and come back to me on that, but I think it's going to be all right. Seven oxen. Okay, I, I kept the wrong city. Oop, faith. And in fact, I, I bumped it up last turn. It's fine. I still want to sell a steel. We have two heat bumps in the hand. I think we lava flows for the card. We're gonna need to mine, or flood rather. Can we get to minus four? Not really. Without buying a couple of steps. Like literally two steps. Which we could do because we have standard tech, but then not have enough for all the other things I want. So. Oh, almost didn't spend the steel. We're spending one steel to get three. So. Pop, up, up. Oh, here's a heat bump. Let's overspend in steel and then assess. Trees is better to get out right away. If I spent 14, it gets reduced by 3, so it's 11. Gives us trees. Now that gives us some money too. We're not going to get up to $14, so just going just gonna to move along this way. Wow. We have a lot of titanium as well. Don't, don't you forget it. Terraforming Ganymede is almost like viable. We need oceans though. We've given up on a lot of ocean cards that came by. Um, okay. I don't think we want any of this. Like copying a production of a building card, I don't think is particularly, like the, the obvious one is strip mining. Nah, bad card draw. We do want actual cards though. Oh, look, AI Central, what do you know? Um. Methane from Titan is a great use of titanium that we have an abundance of. We're going to get a heat bump that I refuse to go the other way on. Tundra farming is also looking pretty guaranteed right now. I'm thinking about spending 18 on an ocean. 
I know I could get a free ocean, but that'll that'll be there for me whether or not I buy an ocean right now. So we're just gonna get a card. Rad suits is fine for a point. Um so this nets me a dollar. Because energy is heat and heat is money. And I bought it. Yeah, it's it's fine. It, it's technically minus one dollars because we'll still have energy in the next one that we may or may not be able to use, but I'm almost certain that we had like the ability having the ability rather is what I'm trying to say having the ability to do two four power actions seems strong but I don't even need it I guess it was just a bad play because I could have just sold it for a dollar do I buy heat to get an ocean Yeah. I think the Earth Catapult was a great play. And everybody felt bad about it because we were really stalling our engine to get going. And now that we're here, we're here. And everyone loves it. Open city, hey -o. Um, Two more cards, please. Hmm. I think first the ocean, which goes here. And then we're gonna restricted area right in there. This to shipyards is like, just why, why would you ever not? I just don't know where to put the open city. Part of me just wants to, you know, play it safe. This could be an example of when, I'm gonna do this despite that being $4 we don't have next round. Because I think this is a good example of when you can terraform the whole planet. Sooner than uh, people would expect. I mean, no, we, we, we only have $66. We can't actually end it because, you know, you buy an aquifer, and you put it here, your greenery into that spot. I don't know, because you can also greenery here. We don't actually have that many cities on the board, right? Is this a city? No. So I'm not worried about maxing out this, this placement. $63, you could place an ocean here and here. That gets you $6 back, plus they're only 15 a pop. So we're down $24. And then 11 three times. Yeah, we, we, we could win this this turn if we wanted to. It's just bad for score. And we only have a plant to sell. I almost forgot about our, our $7. So we're not going to do a move that's bad for score. But I could have done it. I could have done it. It's just one of those games. We like to get knocked to city, I think. Well, I don't know. 
Comet. Like these cards are fine. We're gonna buy a card for two bucks. We have $129 right now. It's a little bit absurd. Cheap greenery, cheap ocean. We have both of the cities that have oxygen requirements because we're just that cool. This spot's just better. Then we put a green right here because Monet's. Monet's. This is just free to play. The St. Jomoms. Oh, large convoy. That's great for us. Do we have an animal cart? We do not. Large convoy, hell yeah. We're gonna put our ocean up here for monies. Monies. Bunch of greens. IO is interesting. Let's sell a steel real quick. Let's make some more steel because we have energy. Money for every city. I think we want to research now. And by the way, if we keep 16 heat, we've, we've won for sure. So. Business contract. Um, view game state. We have some events, so. Do I want to build IO? How much is IO worth right now? Four points. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, brother. This is also just too many points to put down. The rovers we picked up is just tight or steel, so that's free. Um, oh, we didn't put media group down. Well, I feel silly. We're gonna claim this one spot, yay, happy days. We're not picking a titanium up from the board, so this is useless. This is, these are all useless except for plantation. So city for three points here. Two points, two points, two points with a shared. So city here. Um, I mean, greeneries are worth just as much as cities are at this point. So it's just a question of we're going to put that one there. Then we buy another greenery. Which is going to go between the cities. Then we have this cheap greenery. Costs nine heat. See, now, now I'm in territory where I'm like, how much do I need to scoop back up off of the board to be good? We need 16 heat, so we can spend six of it. I'm just gonna click the buttons. I'm not, I'm not gonna put this to a math mistake late at night. We've done the terraforming, yay. Uh, then we sell all these, because they're not worth points.
And then we play our plantation. We need 16 plants to get two granaries, so we might as well just play this here. It's an extra point. And then we're gonna get two more points because we're gonna fill in uh, two spots here and here. Welcome. You no longer have enough points to convert to greeneries. <sighs> breathe it out, breathe it in. 14, 87, 114. Uh, I think that's the third highest or tied for second highest we've ever scored in a winning run. Wow. Helion without heat. Helion not doing heat bumps. Like, good for us. Great times. I hope you enjoyed. Earth Catapult was awesome. I love it. It loves me. It's that simple. Cheers. I'll see you in the next one.